Just let me know how she's doing. Okay? Give you a call. Okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram and a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. Cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. They call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's B. And what? No pleased to meet you? Hmm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. I think Judy's lying. Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Wow, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. And this is the latest from around the world. Oh, hold on. You take the blow-up doll, 
remodel the hole, and, and that's cheap. That's the infidelity. Uh, no. Well, how's that any different from some dull house ass? Because the ass is meat, not latex. That's so hard to understand. Meat, right. No feeling going on, no thinking, no way. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Interesting. Is that normal or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with... unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be? Angel or Sky? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Oh, I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. That it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat it, Johnny. Use for weapons inside. We hope you enjoy your stay. That makes you a real deviant. 
Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This gong don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Calm, sir. Not like you know. We're gonna hack it. Torch you outside. Hi, I'm Sky, and you must be Valerie. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. I was told this place would fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. Come to terms. Sure, let me just curl up on the floor and wait for... <laughs> whatever. Give up. That's what you're saying. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? Death is death is death. You're gone. Game over. You can't know that for certain. Even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it. 
And it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since. Or for what's to come. What I've been through. Tough to move on from that. Death was something that happened to other people. Hell that I dealt to others. Now my number will be up. Wasn't enough I died once. Have to go and do it again. Death's absurdity. The futile struggle before. These terrify you. <sighs> so what now? I know it is. Now, you find out what it is you need to do. Which is? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going where you needed to go. And it won't stop you now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. A single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end. Afterlife. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? A washing machine has a motor. Uh, can we? A lot of things been going on in my head lately. But this was different. Refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here. Come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you, your Eddies and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. Oh, I see. Of course I'm All right, fine. Hand it over and get out before you yeah, land me I in the shit. Bike. I know where to... Anything out of the ordinary happen here lately? Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody would care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where will I find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turned out to be useful after all.
Shoot me! Don't hurt me! Relax, you're not in trouble. Just want to talk for a little. Where's Evelyn? Need to talk to her urgently. It's important. Well, I, are you mad at her or something? Let's no. Know where with. she is or not. Show yourself! Uh, she's not here. Tried calling her more than once. No answer. Heard she was chipping a new faceplate in a clinic in Osaka. No, no. Oslo. That was it. Osaka or Oslo? Which is it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, yeah, definitely Oslo. Evelyn tell you personally she was going away? Um, no, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but we all call him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay. Mr. Forrest, then. Who is he? Um, he's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man.
are you? What do you want? Chill. Keep calm. I'm looking for a girl. Okay, Cap. Someone who plowed through, massacred all along the way. Things got out of hand, I'll admit. But cooperate. And no one else will get hurt. I don't negotiate with terrorists. You're the queen of fuck-ups. You're not helping. Now what? Too bad you can't talk to dead people. Oh, wait. You're doing it now. Anyway, just scour his car. That just might work. Sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get a patch down. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. Turn your weapons. Even though I'd rather not. Mmm. <sighs> 